Arts. That's the name you're thinking of? <laughs> yeah. 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 Uh. <laughs> oh my God. Yeah. I just got back from the mall, and like the title says, I did propless mentalism, which means I walked up to people with nothing other than my voice and their thoughts, and I read their mind. Now, this is my favorite form of mentalism that I'm kind of getting into. This was just practice, this video. But you walk up to people, you tell them to think of something, and you guess it. So in the video example, I had one I had one guy think of his horoscope, and I had one guy you know, think of a name, come down to a name, and I guess both of them. Like you're going to see in the video, their reactions, they are mind blown. So I hope you guys enjoy it. Let's get into the video, and I'll see you after. Now you, you're thinking of a number. What I want you to do is imagine you're thinking 89. You're not, right? All right, that would be cool. All right, so say, for example, 89, you would see 8 and a 9 right in front of you, okay. or right in front of me. And maybe you're more of an analytical thinker, which means like you're better at thinking. I want you to see it as a word. Like example, 98 would be N-I-N-E, blah, 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 see yours. And just focus on the first letter. Okay. Now, yes or no, can you think of a day of the week that begins with this letter? Yes. Okay. Uh, but that's pretty boring. It could be 1 in 7. I could just take a guess. Let's make this a little more hard. Let's make this random. Think, think of a guy's name that begins with this letter, but don't make it like a unisex name. You know, like Tony and Tori could be for both guys and girls. And say for, my name's Jonathan. Say if you're thinking of like a name Jonathan, you would put it in its simplest form in John. Yes. Or Peter would be Pete. Okay, and let me know when you got it. Yes. You got it already? Mm -hmm. All right, so let's gonna test something out with you. Just to see. So obviously you're thinking of like a letter that has three, a name that has three, four, or five letters in it. So I totally think it's the simplest form. You're just gonna take a guess by looking at him. Do you think it's three, four, or five letters? Just look at him, he's gonna send it to you. Four? No. Was she close to five? Yeah. So you got the five. All right. <clears throat> so just repeat the name over and over in your head. Okay. Like for like like Frank, 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 Frank. Oh my gosh, what? That's the name you're thinking of? <laughs> yeah. 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 <laughs> oh my <God>. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Thank you. Shit. Thank you. Do you know your horoscope sign? Like, you know, you're reading the newspaper and it tells you about yourself? No. No, does anyone here just know their horoscope sign off the top of their head? You know yours? <clears throat> now, if I said... If I, <laughs> don't say it, don't say it. What I want you to do is, honestly, because some are really big and hard to spell, can you spell this without seeing it, like, in your head? What? Like, could you... Could you... trouble spelling. Can you spell your horoscope in your head? Like, for example, if you're thinking Leo, L-E-O. You know, can you do that? I'm not saying, I know you can, but I'm saying if it's too hard. Okay, awesome, awesome. I know it's a rigorous process. We're just going to go with it. Now, when I, when I snap, you're going to spell it in your head letter by letter. But don't move your eyes. Don't count with your fingers because then I could just assume how many letters are in it. So just count in your head right now and tell me when you're done. Okay, so now I see, now you visualized it. Now, the way I pick things up, if I have somebody think of something like, say, house, I get the E, the S, the U. It doesn't come in all together. So you're gonna help me out. You're just gonna bounce letter to letter in the horoscope, just randomly. So don't think of it from start to finish, just random letters. Okay, just go like that. And stop, go back. There's an R. It's also an A. There's not an I, is there? Yeah, I thought so. Keep, keep going, keep going. There's an S. And an E. No E. Okay, okay. I feel like you're shutting me out. It's not your fault. No, no, it's not your fault. It's not your fault. <laughs> Repeat it over and over in your head. Okay? Like Aquarius. 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 No. <laughs> you're an Aquarius? <laughs> that's, that's weird, right? A little bit. That's a little bit, right? But now... He's an alien. <laughs> Alright guys, simple as that. You saw I had to think of something. I read their mind. And they loved it. And before I get 100 comments down below asking where you can learn mentalism, I've said it before, I'm going to shamelessly plug it again. On my Patreon, $1 a month, you can learn mentalism. You can go over there and learn mentalism. I put up videos all the time, and you can learn this powerful mentalism for yourselves. It's totally worth it, and you're not really going to learn this mentalism anywhere else. Because mentalism is hard to learn. It's hard to find good sources. But I've been doing it for a while that I have all this stuff that I'm willing to teach you guys if you donate to me. So if you already do... Thank you, I appreciate it. If you're gonna, thank you. If you can't, then just keep watching because I'm gonna keep posting on here. And if you like stuff like this, more of the propolis mentalism stuff, or even the mentalism stuff in general, please hit the thumbs up button and comment below so I know and I'll definitely do more videos for you guys.
because I have another video coming probably next week after this video. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Until next time, guys. Peace.